Prince Christian of Denmark, the eldest son of Crown Prince Frederick and Crown Princess Mary, is next in line to the Danish throne after his father. However, his future marriage plans may be complicated by a centuries-old royal protocol that prohibits members of the Danish royal family from marrying individuals from their own country. Before we proceed, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. The protocol, which dates back to the 18th century, was established to prevent the concentration of wealth and power within the royal family. It requires members of the royal family to marry foreigners, ensuring that the Danish throne remains connected to other European royal families and preventing the risk of inbreeding. This protocol may pose a challenge for Prince Christian, who is now 17 years old and approaching the age where he may start considering marriage. If he wishes to marry a Danish woman, he may be forced to choose between his love for her and his duty to the throne. However, it's worth noting that this protocol is not a formal law and can be changed or waived by the monarch. Queen Margrethe II, Prince Christian's grandmother, has the power to make exceptions to this rule if she sees fit. In recent years, there have been instances where members of the Danish royal family have married Danes, suggesting that the protocol may not be as rigid as it once was. Nonetheless, Prince Christian's situation highlights the complexities and challenges that come with being a member of a royal family. The Danish royal family has a history of marrying foreigners, with Crown Princess Mary being a prime example. She was born in Australia and married Crown Prince Frederick in 2004. Prince Christian's parents' marriage has been seen as a success, and it remains to be seen whether he will follow in their footsteps and marry a foreigner. Ultimately, Prince Christian's marriage plans will depend on various factors, including his personal preferences, the wishes of his family, and the needs of the Danish monarchy. While the centuries-old protocol may present a challenge, it's unlikely to be the only consideration in his decision. As Prince Christian navigates his future, he will likely face intense media scrutiny and public interest.